Hello and good morning and welcome back to another Loot Theme Park Thrills YouTube video where today I'm here at Blackpool Pleasure Beach uh, for the first visit of the 2024 season. I haven't been in over a year now. Uh, we're walking in about half ten, a bit late coming into the park, uh, but not many rides are open. Most of the rides will open at about 11 o'clock. I can see the big one tested, so we'll be hitting up that later. And the UK's second tallest roller coaster and third fastest. I've uh, never done it before. Uh, we're going to start off with Infusion because that is the only major coast which is open. Uh, I do need to get that cred. Uh, we need to get four creds today. The big one, Infusion, Revolution and the Big Dipper. So we're going to start off with Infusion, the Vacoma SRC which opened back in 2007. Um, so let's go over to Infusion. So then change of plan, the big one is open. So we're going to start here uh, on the 213 foot um, Arrow Hyper Coaster which opened back in 1994. Um, and then we'll go back and do probably do Icon, but uh, go join the big one queue. Uh, the queue is currently outside the main entrance, so we'll see how long it is. So they just came off the big one, the 213 foot 1994 Arrow Hyper Coaster, uh, cred number 36 for me. I decided to wait for the front row, which uh, made it a bit better. It was very rough though compared to Hyper. Definitely the weakest Hyper Coaster I've done. Um, but the video was good, the first drop was. Um, and a bit, bit of a monorail with the airtime hills uh, is very rough. Even the retrack work is also rough. Uh, then we're going to do some dark rides now, do Wallace and Gromit, Philomatic, and also Ghost Train while the queues are quiet. Icon's going on a 75 minute queue, so we're going to do that later. Revolution's on a 20 minute queue, but that keeps going down as well. So we're going to do some dark rides, wait about an hour for the big one. It's a very busy day here at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. So then it's time for the Ghost Train, the classic 1930s haunted house ride, um, to have some dark rides this afternoon. leaving the park to get some dinner because you can't actually take any food inside so I thought I'll come in the gift shop while I'm here got some great merch including this big one uh, classic um, merchandise over here we've got some Valhalla and Icon stuff I'll probably go having a ride on Icon after we come through the park um, I'm gonna be doing Ghost Train was quite good though great thing maybe we'll see the coffee you know um, not gonna be as good as Robbie Curse on the manor Got some Crocs over here with your add-ons. Don't wear Crocs myself. Valhalla over here. No disease. As this is for Blackpool Football Club, they have a deal with the sponsorship with Pleasure Beach Resort. And then just down there is the Icon stuff. Here are the Icon hoodies. Yeah, we'll be on a ride on Icon. Have to grab some dinner. Yeah, just to leave the park. You're not allowed to take food in the park for some reason. Uh, but it is what it is, get some good views of the big one. So let's get the lift kids out to the park.
just came back from lunch then. Um, I absolutely love this entrance to the park because you've got flying machines and then Ice Blast and obviously the, the south of Valhalla behind. But Ice Blast is still shut for the whole season and I think this will be going very shortly. And we'll see the new Pendulum ride coming in for the 2025 season. Uh, but we're going to do Icon now, the 2018 Mac launch coaster. I absolutely love this view with obviously the big ones turning around and just seeing the view off. That was a great ride. Uh, but we've done big one and go straight today. Um, time for Icon. So then on the Pleasure Beach Express now. Um, yeah, so had a ride on the uh, Icon, front row. So good, great air time, great hang time on the inversions. Um, we decided to come on the Pleasure Beach Express. I was going to film on here. I'll get some views of the park. There's the big one. Had a ride on there this morning, front row ride. There's the queue on there. And just down there is the uh, monorail track that we've actually still monorail from the park. Still here today.
there's Big Dipper, opened back in 1923, it's 101 years old, haven't done that yet, hopefully I'll do that today. And there's obviously Infusion, originally opened as Traumatiser in 1991 at Southport Pleasureland, before moving to Infusion in 2007, and obviously Icon, great ride on Icon there, front row ride. Put in the comments down below if you think Icon has one or two in Infusions. Great ride, great air time. Hold on, I can't. It's actually got up to second in my rankings. Is that an inversion? Comment down below. It's about on the queue, he's out at the entrance, but uh, moving quite quick. There's the train. Some people on Enzo there. new credit for me to get an infusion. Hopefully I'll do that later. Needs to be a big different evolution as well. Gonna see how I can't come around soon. There's Big Dipper. We'll be doing that later, hopefully. And obviously, the queue is about an hour for the Big Dipper. Uh, we're just going to see if we can do, do it today. Because so I need to get three new crowds at the park. This is the South Station. Uh, so, it stops if there's um, hotels. Obviously, it's not stopping today because there's still quite a few parts left. There's a big blue hotel. Never stayed in there before, but you get some great views of all the coasters, including the big one here. You just see the big dip up close. Icon should be coming around soon, not sure if you'll be able to see it. Very close to the big dip here. Yeah.
then just came off Wallace and Gromit Thermatic the ride. Um, great dark ride that is. Uh, one of my favourite rides here at Blackpool Pledge Beach. Going to do the Big Dipper now, which opened back in 1923. It's 101 years old. Um, and we're going to go and ride the classic wooden coaster. Um, trying to do a fusion revolution as well today. I hope they get another ride on Icon and Big One later. And they'll do all the coaster credits here at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. So we're going to do Infusion instead because the Big Dipper queue is quite long. You can see 2007 Vekoma SLC, which originally opened back in 1999 as Traumatizer. It's Southland Pleasure Land. came off in Fusion, the 2007 Vekoma SLC, and that was the worst roller coaster I have ever done. I got a back row and it was so rough. I've got a massive headache now. Um, I didn't even want to do Big Dipper or Revolution anymore after that. Um, that was absolutely one of the worst rides I have ever done. I would definitely rather do Blue Flyer, Octonauts roller coaster adventure, and even the Wacky Worms can t compared to Infusion. That's how rough it was. Definitely the worst coaster I've ever ridden. Here's Revolution then, the 1979 classic Arrow shuttle coaster. And um, not going to do it today, but look how close you get to the track here. That's absolutely amazing. So you get some great views. I'll get some off by footage for you. Um, but we've got about two hours till park close. So I'm probably going to end the day on the ride on the big one and the Icon. Hopefully, we're going to do a back row on both. Uh, but that ride on Infusion was awful. So I'm here for Steeple Chase. Uh, I'm not going to be doing it today because the queue is quite big. It's not one of my favourites anyway. Uh, but it's actually good fun this. Um, if you haven't done it before, definitely do it, do it again. I'm also not going to be doing next trip today, I've done it before. Yeah, again, that's really good, but um, I don't really want to wait too much now. I mean, most rides are over an hour. Um, but just going to get some off our foot for icon and the big one, and then I'll wrap up my day.
So then just like that, your back room had an icon. Uh, that was great, full of air time and hang time. We've got about half an hour to a park close, so we're going to do the big one for one last time. Are you here? Go with all this still. Do you see you there? And um, so hopefully, it's not too busy now, about half an hour, I'd say, this will take us to the end of the day. Um, and that will be the end of the day here at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. Five minutes till park closed and I've just came off the back row of the big one. It was so rough, uh, but it was great fun on the back. Uh, definitely prefer the front. Uh, we've got about five minutes, so before I go, I've joined the queue for Icon and I'm going to go and get a fun row ride to end the day here at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. It has been a great day and um, after this, I'll some off my footage, I will uh, wrap up the vlog and show my opinion on the day. As you can see here, I'm actually the last person in the key for Icon, so I'll be on the last train of the day um, on the Max 2018 launch coaster. came off Icon, the last train of the day, last person in the queue actually who got a back row ride, uh, filled with air time and hang time, great ride on that. Uh, it's been such a good day here at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. Um, can't wait to be back, hopefully we're probably going to be back next year to get on more rides. Um, but um, if you've enjoyed, make sure you like and subscribe, make sure you follow my Instagram at Luke's Theme Park Thrills. I've been Luke, goodbye. <laughs>